Vol uh, Voltron. What uh, What did you guys think? Sorg, you can go first if you want. <coughs> Sorry. Um, I thought it was tremendous. Um, of course, uh, it, it supposedly kind of leaked out early-ish. I think it was supposed to premiere over the weekend in front of something. Well, um, Sorg, the reason it leaked out was because if you watch Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D., uh, Reyna released Agent Simmons' picture to all of Hydra, and I'm pretty sure that had the Age of Ultron trailer attached mm, to it. Of course, so, of course. Uh, but fantastic. It's all connected. It's all connected, Sork. It's definitely darker. They're showing more locations. Uh, this idea that the team was going to be split up a little bit. We got glimpses of Scarlet Witch and this version of Quicksilver, who we saw in the uh, uh, this past year's uh, 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 X-Men Days Future Past. Days of Future Past. Um, so, uh, we'll see what they do with those, with these, these not mutants, special people versions that they're going to be doing. Um, but no, I, I, it, it's got me interested. I want to see more, uh, of it. Uh, I, I'm kind of curious what they're going to do with Ultron. Obviously, uh, for those that maybe uh, have read the age of Ultron, there's a comic book series. that was a summer event last year i think this is not that which kind of lends to and we'll get to it later in the show uh civil war is not going to be what you read and um but still it's it's going to be a fun ride i think what do you yeah. think of the trailer let's stick with just the trailer for right now mike i've got no strings to hold me down i've never been more creeped out by pinocchio in my entire life. <laughs> I swear, you know, when Disney took over Marvel, people were saying, oh man, Disney's going to ruin everything. I think this might have been the only reason that Marvel was like, hey, I'm glad we're owned by Disney because now we can say Ultron Guess was a puppet now. and now he's a marionette and now he's a real boy. But Jesus, that trailer, just everything about that, there's so much stuff in there. And the parody trailers that have come out are even better. I posted one on the Facebook group of instead of the I've Got No Strings to Hold Me Down song, they play the Celine Dion song from Titanic. <laughs> and somehow it works almost better. Almost better. Um, go, to our, go to our Facebook group. Look at that. And just marvel at the sheer brilliance. I know you haven't wanted to hear that Celine Dion song in 13 years. Trust me, it's worth it. How about you, Malenka? <laughs> um, I will say when it started, I wasn't that impressed. Primarily because I felt like a lot of the shots were still shots that we'd already seen. So it's like, oh, well, they're just showing us the video version of this. And then they showed the beast mode Iron Man going up against Hulk. And I said... Hey, now I'm intrigued. And they also show the broken in half shield. Um, I also thought the uh, the narration from Ultron was rather intriguing. So with that being said, I am interested. Um, it definitely piqued my interest. But that could also just lead into 